It is time for our Perkins Kreitzer construction lightning round. A lot of things on the list today. And uh, we want to thank Perkins Kreitzer construction for making this possible. And we have some Perkins Kreitzer construction news uh, because they are working with Bobify, uh, which opened just a couple days ago at 3838 North 168th Street. That's in a retail strip near the Walmart Superstore, northwest of 168th and West Maple Road. The franchise sells bubble tea. It is owned by Braintune Cafe, uh, a franchise out of uh, California, uh, with also uh, locations in Texas and New Jersey. But uh, Perkins Kreitzer Construction built out that Bobify. And last week we told you that they're building out the new Hawaiian Brothers restaurant in the former Boston Market in Miracle Hills. But guess what? They don't just do restaurants. Uh, you can hire them for your office building, your office build out, uh, churches, uh, you Warehouse. name it. Warehouse. They do it. Yeah, if it's a building, they'll build it. Perkins Kreitzer Construction. Dave Kreitzer leads the team. You can find them online at p-cconstruction.com. All right, a couple quick things here. First watch, we'll open another Omaha location October 14th in Hartwood Preserve. Reserve. Bad Seed Coffee and Supply has opened a second location at 50th and Dodge next to Felius Cat Cafe. The original shop uh, in, um, opened in 2014 at 24th and Harney. Dave's Hot Chicken opening in the former Voodoo Taco, former Jones Brothers, Sheridan's. former some other stuff uh, building at 180th and Center. Dave's Hot Chicken out of Los Angeles is a Nashville hot chicken concept. Uh, current Omaha location, first Omaha location, is at thirty is at thirty three five North Saddle Creek Road. Um, we have um, Sweet Beans Coffee planning to open in late October near one hundred ninety second and Harrison Street, and Dog Gone Problems, a dog training and play care facility, is set to open September twentieth at 134th and West Center Road. I see what they did there. And another piece of retail news is uh, Shampong Lanes and Ghost Donkey opening next week. These are downtown uh, in the Mercantile District, in the new Brickline Building, and more concepts from Flagship Restaurant Group. And finally, Lego opened today. Yes, you are correct, sir. Saving and the best for last. Saving the best for last. Here, We Nebraska are out here Nebraska. at Nebraska Crossing. So, John Skrakus, uh, we talked to you briefly earlier in the show. You're the food and beverage guy uh, here at Nebraska Crossing. What types of restaurants might we expect to join the lineup in the, in the coming year or so? Yeah, for sure. Um, well, for sure, we talked about Paradise Bakery. And with the youth sports, that goes kind of hand in hand, obviously. You want healthy options for, for the parents and the kids. Um, you know, we're planning on opening up uh, a Mediterranean style restaurant that I'll be part of, that Rod and I will be part of, um, kind of like a traditional pita restaurant. Um, we're excited about that. But I think we're most excited. You named a lot of brands that are coming to the area. Um, Small Sliders, we just signed a franchise agreement with them. And we're going to bring them to the Big Ten Crossing and throughout Nebraska. We're super excited about them. Uh, sliders, fries, shakes. I mean, it's a great, great concept. Um, you mentioned Drew Brees earlier. He's a spokesperson. He's a franchise O holder. Um, it's exciting. It's really exciting. And uh, small ciders, uh, they're kind of a southern concept. Yeah, they started down in New Orleans by a couple mm -hmm. LSU football players, um, and now they've taken they've ramped it up. Now they brought in some really big pl big time players, and um, and they've just regrouped and and they're growing like crazy and we're super excited to be part of nebraska with them yeah they're um they'll have 300 units open jeff uh by this time next year small sliders well really they're okay. on fire where's yeah. the where's the closest right now uh shoot new orleans i guess they've the ones that are open are more east towards atlanta yeah um and then they're coming north yeah. so, okay but as far as open you'd have to go to new orleans yep bring it on yeah, oh, yeah. Trent, you lived in New Orleans back when uh, you were my old stomping grounds, absolutely. Tulane University. Come on, yeah. Okay, so uh, the uh, the Paradise Bakery and Cafe will be on the northwest corner um, of the mall, and we already talked about that opening pretty soon. And and that gives you guys a, a nice, you know, sit-down concept, but that is also a, a quick you know, it's also yeah, quick, quick serve as well. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, for sure. And, you know, we can give people, they can come in and have coffee, stay there all day, do their work if they want. They can come in and have a quick 
bite. Um, obviously, we need to bring some sit-down restaurants in here to keep people here for a couple hours. Obviously, that's our goal, and we will work on that. Yeah, I forgot. I need to give a shout out to Kong Dog. I don't know. You know, I just want to say I was wondering that we, about that. We actually opened them. If you haven't seen the Korean um, corn dog, I mean, you can see people walking around, meat on a stick. We're playing 35 seconds. Yep, and uh, it's it's. I understand it's pretty good because when I've been out here, you see people walking around with those things. Might have to give that a try before I leave. Absolutely. If you like this video, be sure to hit those like and subscribe buttons. And remember, Grow Omaha is not just media. This is a mission. We are trying to build up Omaha. Omaha and make it an even better place. We can only do that with your help. Share this video with your friends, neighbors, and family.